and the stick how to unbox it you just have to remove uh, it comes with uh, this small cloth this is a factory testing um, you have your manual you also have it comes with a uh, extra button extra needle needle trader little trader comes with all that you need all this to be able to uh, work effectively it uses adapter you can use a DC if you have adapter cable you fix it here you fix to electricity and then you are I mean good to go it also uses batteries for you turn two down two up it has this lock here if you are fixing in your uh, your cloth or whatever you want to sew you don't want the 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 the, the upper part to be moving up and down all you need to do is that you lock it here it has this locker and then you can only use the rotary wheel to move it up and down like that okay and then uh, it comes with the uh, the thread fix already so once you pick it you can start you can start using the machine but sometimes you want to change the the thread you want to change the color or it's finished you want to change it um all you need to do is to remove this side gently you just pull it gently and it's removed so there is always uh, this spring. Make sure that uh, the spring doesn't pull off. You have, if you are using a longer thread, this uh, barbin, you have a longer one, then you use this one, then you fix it here. Alright? You fix it here. But if you are not using the long one, short one like this, then you fix it here. Make sure your spring is already there then you fix this one on it uh, you start by first going through this side this is the first stitch you go through this one good then this is the tension this is what you use to control the stitches whether it's too loose or too tight if it is too loose you turn it to the right like this if it's too tight you turn it to the left so whilst you are sewing that's what you use to control the, the the thickness the size the spacing and all that so um this one must go through the upper part it doesn't go through it in a circular motion it goes just goes through halfway then there is this ring down there so this must go through the ring like this it goes through the ring um, like that the last stage is to channel the um, the thread through the needle it comes with this <coughs> needle threader and it helps you to I mean thread it so all you do is to put this one well you have a small loop then you channel the thread through that loop then you pull it you are done
see how it sews. Let's sew something and see how you can use this machine to sew. So I have this as my material, my dress or whatever. You lift it up. Then you remove the uh, you remove the lock. You you your your thumb should always be on the 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 the, the knob here when you are sewing, and then it sews from left to the right. So you always fix it at this end. You can use this hand to support it at this end. Then Good. When you get to the end of your sewing, you can lock the top like this and then you raise the needle to the highest point. Then you use your right hand to lift this one. Then you can now remove your, your cloth from the machine. So you can turn it once like this up and down to release the turn for you. Make sure you press the end here because there is a loop here you are going to use to lock it pull it a little longer you cut when you cut when you pull this side it will unravel and remove the whole stitch so there is a loop here you need to use to lock to lock it so you open the loop you make sure that you open the loop and then this will go through it and then once it passes through it it's locked once it locks you have a very solid very solid it, it's very very solid like that you see Place of people saying that it's not sewing, and then what we realize is that sometimes uh, the needle goes too deep. If the needle goes too deep uh, and you are sewing, you realize that it will not sew. When it happens like that, all you need to do is to do adjustment or adjust the needle. You try to push it down a bit, and then it will work. Yeah. You can lose it like this, then this one you can pull it out or adjust it and then fix it back. That is it. Then important lesson in fixing the needle there is a, a, a flat edge which must always be in front and make sure that the hole of the needle is facing is facing the front part of the machine so it moves from the front to the back or from the back to the front it doesn't move from side to side so in fixing you have to be mindful of that all right.